You're watching Screw It on Supple Wine. I'm your host, Mike Supple. Screw caps should make wine a lot more convenient to drink. First off, you don't have to fumble with a corkscrew, and second, you're pretty sure the wine inside the bottle is not going to be spoiled. But if you've had screw cap wine before, you probably know that it's not always as simple to open as it really should be. Fortunately, there's a little trick that can help you so you never have to worry about fumbling with that screw cap bottle in front of your friends again. Rather than grabbing the bottle by the top and opening it like a jar, the easier way is just hold that capsule by the bottom collar, grab the bottle with your other hand, and twist the bottle clockwise until you hear that crack. And you know the bottle's open, easy to untwist, and you're ready to go. And if you're wondering what bottle of wine I'm playing around with right here, it's the 2004 Killerman's Run Shiraz from the winery Killacanoon. Now, this wine is always a great little juicy Shiraz. 2004 is actually several years old. They're on the 2007 vintage, I think, right now. But I like this wine. It's a good value. It's always under $20. And actually, I held onto this bottle just to see what they, what they do when, when they age, see how they hold up over time. So I just want to take a quick taste of it right now. All right. Still got nice dark purple color you expect from a Shiraz. Very juicy. You got some... Dark sort of blackberry in there, black cherry. <sighs> Little bits of caramel and spice in the background. Still smells really nice. Hmm. And it's still a very tasty wine. Maybe not one that I'd want to lay down for many more years, but it's got good acid in there. There's actually some nice strong tannins supporting the body. A lot of bright fruit. It's still tasting really good right now. So if you happen to have a local retailer that's got some of this on the shelf, I wouldn't be too concerned that they're on the 2007 vintage and that's 2004. It's really tasty stuff. 